Hello, everybody. My name is Uncle Steve. Uh, that thing is dead. I forgot how powerful I am. Uh, but yeah, so a little bit of research in regards to what I have to do next. And I think, if memory serves correctly, uh, there is a key that either I picked up or have to pick up. And I think I've picked up the key, if I'm being right. Could be wrong, but we'll find out in just a second. Um, because there's a spot over there, which I think the key I picked up after beating the Lord of Soul, or the Lord of uh, Doors, allows me to unlock. Hey, it does. So now, the good news is, by doing this, I now effectively have turned the world to night. And now that the world is in night, there are pink ghosts. I don't know... I don't know what I'm supposed to do with the pink ghosts, though. Hmm. Do the pink ghosts hurt me? They don't. Okay, good. Um... So I guess... What I have to do is I have to lead this ghost over to where the Lord of Doors statue, if I remember correctly, which is this thing over here. Come on, big guy. Right? Okay, that is right. All right. Oh, well, I've done that statue. Now what? Unless there are more statues I have to deal with. There's that guy. Let's go see if we can find the next statue before he follows us too far. So there must be one over here somewhere. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, it's right here. Duh. Okay, get him to follow over here. There we go. There's another. So that's two. This will be a tad bit confusing on my end as well, because I have to remember what I'm actually doing. Considering I got poo brain and I can't really remember it. Oh, okay. So that's the door we're opening. So we got to find six. Okay, that makes a little bit more sense as to why they said six beforehand. Uh, is there anything actually over here? No. Okay, good. Except that statue over there. Okay, maybe, maybe, maybe actually pay attention to what we're doing here. Probably would help. Yeah, no, that'd be too easy. Oh god, he's still following me from that distance. Okay, so that's three. Alright, so that's three of the Lord Door Vessel thingies. The good news is, each one kind of gives me an indication of where the next statue might be, so I kind of just have to keep my eyes open when doing it. Ooh. Nice, we have some stronger enemies now in this area. I just realized, none of the weaker enemies are here, so yeah, this is like, kind of endgamey. Which is nice to see. Come on, big guy. Come on, you can make it. And... There we go. So that's four. Two more to go. Keep my eyes open for the... the Lord stuff. I know there's one way back in the beginning where the door was. Now the real question is if I could find one that's not all the way back in the beginning. No, I'm sorry. My boy is chilling in a coffin. Nah, 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 nah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. You, evening reaper. I don't really sleep anymore. I lie here each night wondering how it would feel to no longer be living. 
If we were dead, would we even know? Well, he is just an absolute ball of sunshine, so... I guess we'll just leave him be. Alright, so... Uh, Alright, so we did the loop before. There's nothing over there. We dropped that soul over there. Um, maybe there's one up here? Like, who knows? Let's go find out, shall we? I don't think there's a soul down here. I could be wrong, but something tells me there probably wouldn't be. Nah, okay, so there's no soul down in here. All I gotta do now is I gotta go check by the door. See if there's one over there as well. Alright, so yeah, nothing on this side of the map. It is weird that there's no music at all. Which, I'm not gonna lie, is a little... Just a tad bit unsettling. Alright, so we're back at the beginning now. Let's see... If perhaps I just missed one by running around like a moron for a bit. Nothing there. Okay, nothing over there, nothing over there. So let's go back and talk to our ghost friend over here. Okay, now the question is, where is this statue? Right here, okay. Come on, you big guy. Come on. Come on. There we go. The only thing I could think... So he's there, and okay, so the last one's right down here. Wait, there's more than six ghosts? Uh. Huh. Did I do it right? Was it seven? Okay, I must have done it right. Okay, it was seven, not six. I was not keeping track with the lights. Hey, spooky noises. Still really unsettling with the no audio, or sorry, I'd say no music going on. Oops. Let's try that again. Okay, so we're back here. Which, if I remember correctly, there's that, but we don't care about that because we already got it. But the door is right there. Yeah, I'm only missing one relic. Ancient tablet of knowledge. Alright, so there's another one. Is it going to make me do that for, like, is that what the pink light means? That there's these statues that I have to deal with? Like, is that the thing? I don't know why, but I feel like that's the thing. I could be wrong. I could be absolutely wrong, but... It feels like the light's the thing. Uh, yeah, we're gonna enter here. Okay. Now we're back. So yeah, the pink light doesn't really mean that. Alright, never mind. Um, I want to go to the top of the mountain. So for me to go to the top of the mountain, I have to go... This way. Yeah, because I have to go here. Uh, this is the easiest way to get there. Lair. Go through here. And then I remember the stairs up here, which now that it's nighttime, that moon crest should mean something. Maybe. Ah, it does, see? Yeah, see, look at that. 
and I found the mysterious locket. Some kind of soul energy swirls within it. Here lies Monty. He was a good boy and my dearest friend. His time in this world is over. May he rest in peace. Oh, wait. Oh. That's our boy Hedgestone. He buried his dog this high up on the mountain? Or I should say pet? Damn, man. Yeah, sure, that's not totally sad. It make me cry. I have no idea how many nuggets of the knowledge I need. If I'm being real. Oops. <laughs> um I guess. Let me go back to. Let me go back to the cemetery. I feel like now that I have all the relics. That one door may be open now. Like, there's no guarantee that door's open, but it'd be nice if it was. Like, let's put it that way. Hey, I see. The door's open. Oh, snap. Are we gonna fight Hedgestone? Oh, oh, shit. Oh, hello again. Hello again, Reaper. For some reason, I stirred from my usual resting place tonight. I could feel something calling out to me. Hmm. Oh? You found my old locket? Hmm. I haven't seen that since... Hmm. Since the day I buried my only friend. The day the ground shook and the sky turned black. I feel... So strange. Uh oh. No, Hedgestone. I don't want to fight you. Oh, Hedgestone, no. Stone's got some moves. Stone, you bastard. Oh, I thought I, we could have gotten it first try. Oh, that makes me sad. I don't want to fight Hedgestone, though. Damn it, dude. Like, he's my bro. Such a chill son of a gun. I don't want to have to fight the boy. I mean, I'm gonna, but... I don't want to. I'm sorry, Hedgestone. I really am.
sorry, Hedgestone. Thank you, Reaper. My time in this world is over. Man, that sucks. And I have to go kill Hedgestone like that. I feel its eyes gazing to my soul. I also feel a pit in my soul. Man, is he gonna be in the bear? No, he's just gone. Damn it, dude. Hedgestone was so chill. And I knew we we're gonna have to fight him eventually, but. Oh, man. That hurt. Like, that legitimately makes me upset. I'm assuming the Hall of Doors is letting me know where these relic things are supposed to be. The only other one I know of, location-wise, is the one that's on top of the mountain where I have to light the fire. So I'm gonna go there. We're afraid to go anywhere else. No. No. Actually... Yes. I do want to be in the camp. And the reason I say yeah to that is because then I can go and maybe find out. One, two, three, four. So yeah, I do need four more. Holy shit. Okay. Is he alive? Like, I think he is, but... Yeah, okay, he's just chilling. What about you? Ah, oh, the simple joy of TV. Some say it's not good for you to watch it all the time. You've got to allow yourself a reward now and then. But here's the thing, though, dude. You're, you've been watching that TV for, you know, ever. <laughs> you son of a gun. All right. Now, if I go up... This should be the beginning of the castle, right? Because it... right? Yes. Yes, it is. Okay, good. So now I can light the fires without worrying about them going out. Which is nice to see. Okay. And I probably could have been here anyway if I took the other path. Damn it! For a crow, you like falling to your death. Like, a lot. Like, a ridiculous amount, a lot. Okay. Okay, so that's three. I've got three more I gotta find. And I think they're all in these towers, so I just gotta keep my eyes open for these towers and buildings and stuff. Yes, take my time and look. The one thing I will say that's weird is that, like, there are no enemies. Like, we saw one enemy. And, I mean, granted, we did kick its ass pretty quickly, but... Yeah, there are no bad guys. And that's a little weird, if I'm being honest. Alright, so I gotta find two more. Right. Where, oh, where... Could these other two be? Hmm. Well, there's one. Which I just have to... And there's the other one. Okay. So we got them both. I just gotta get down there for that one. Okay, that would explain this little drop-off area here. And there it goes. <laughs> Off the cliff. Whoops. 
I don't know why I thought I could have made that jump. All right. There's another door open. Now the question is, is that going to be a boss? Or is it just another door? So far we got rid of Hedgestone. And that was the only real boss fight boss fight we had. Even though I'm going to miss him. Man. Fucking... Can't believe... I had to go fight Hedgestone. Alright, now it's just gonna give me the nugget of knowledge. Ancient tablet. Okay. I think I'm gonna stop here. Thank you all for watching. My name has been Uncle Steve. Uh, we're gonna find out where the other three are next time. Uh, please subscribe, and until next time, take care.